Baby, I must confess, I was captivated by your beauty. Thanks for the compliments. You're welcome. <laughs> I just feel like taking you home to be my wife. You are an angel. <laughs> Baby, you are different. You are not all girls. Your beauty is captivating. I must confess, I am overwhelmed. Do you have what it takes? What will it take? Name your prize. <laughs> Okay, let me see. I want to know you more, okay? Okay. So what do you do? <laughs> I'm a businessman. An importer. An exporter. Clearing and folding in general merchandise. Really? It sounds interesting. <laughs> so, I don't know. Sorry, let me go. I want to know you more, right? You're free. So, where do you live? <laughs> I stay in GRA. To be precise, number six in a cabal. Yeah. Oh, wow. So, what kind of car do you have? Did you say car? Yeah, car. <laughs> Maybe I have cars. I have cars. Cars. I have a Homer Jeep. Okay. I have a Mitsubishi Outlander. I have an Xterra G. Really? And I have an Amanda. It's a Nissan product. <laughs> In that case, I think um, I will agree with your proposal. This is good. <laughs> That's my baby girl. <laughs> Let me just take this. That's it. Look at you. <laughs> okay. In that case, I should be packing in tomorrow so that we'll put tests together and plan things. That's good. I love that. I love that. We're so moving into my house tomorrow. Yeah. I'm gonna marry you well. <laughs> <laughs> You're a beautiful angel. Thank you.
I'm glad you like it. <laughs> I like it, not I love it. This is good. So, where's my bedroom? That's what I mean. You should know I'm busy. Eh? I am busy. Uh -uh. I hear that you are living with a woman in, in your house. Is it true? <laughs> Mama, that is the woman I want to marry. Her name is Flogsy. Ah. Flogsy. Where is she from? Somewhere in Anambra State. Somewhere. Have you seen her parents? Mama, I've not seen her parents. You have not done any traditional rites. Mama, we will do the traditional marriage and the white wedding on the same day. Are you? I, I believe you're out of your mind. Why? Why did you say that, Mama? What's the problem? You go onto the street, find a girl, pick her, bring her into your house, and start living with her as husband and wife. No investigation, no consultation, no traditional rights, not even to talk about wedding. Mama, this is computer age. Ah. I'm too busy with my business. I don't have such time. Besides, we are adults. Ah. <laughs> have you studied her character? To know her family background and all that kind of thing that is necessary. Mama, Floxy is a very beautiful girl. She's tall. She's fair. She's also a graduate. Ah, I can compromise her character for all these other qualities. No. Ah. <laughs> no. Chooks, let me tell you. I am not part of this, your marriage. If you don't do the right things the right way, they should be done. Mama. Besides, this is abomination before God. Whether you give your consent or not, that is not a problem. Besides, she has already moved into my house. I'm suddenly living as husband and wives. Eh? Ah! <laughs> oh! Darling! Ah, so this is... Darling! Hello, madam! Me, madam! Is this what I'm going to be seeing? This! Me! Madam! Hey! After all the training and all the money I spent on you, madam! Now, listen, my son! All that glitters is not gold. What a man, an old man sits down on a chair to see. A young man climbs on a rock or tree. He will not see it. Mama, you are not an old man, but an old woman. Mm -hmm. And besides, ah, <laughs> with computer and satellite everywhere, a young boy will see anything he wants to see, and the old man will not see. This is computer age, Mama. <laughs> Me, I'm going home. Live with your wife. <laughs> Darling, please get something for Mama to eat. Me, eat what? Me, I'm going home. Live with your wife. Mama, wait now. I'm going to buy 